Welcome back, everybody, to Undead Lake Sam, an old guy gaming. And in this episode, we are going to get back to working on our um, our base here. Uh, so we got the kitchen pretty much done in the last episode, as well as the bathroom. So this is all finished in here. And now what we want to do uh, is work in here <clears throat> and work to start getting our armory uh, done, which is going to be in this central room here. So I got a lot of stuff that needs to be uh, torn out. Did I loot that? I did loot that. And taken apart and that sort of thing. So um, let's go ahead and start off then with a time lapse and get some stuff torn out and then we'll rebuild it back up the way we want. <laughs> All right, guys, um, I haven't fully really decided how things are going to go in here. Um, like, I don't know if I want to make the whole entire room just one big open room or if we might want to keep some of this and make this like a vault in here. Uh, so I want to look at that some more. So let's go back into um, here and get this get this going. So we want to move the research desk into here for sure. And I went down below and looked at, um, you know, how they did some of the other office desks. Uh, the, the actual desks, desks themselves look like shit, so we're, <laughs> we're not going to use those. I haven't decided whether or not I want to take this out either, but I think I do because, yeah, um, well, I'll tell you what, let's leave that alone for the moment. Let's leave that alone for the moment. Okay, so basically, um, I want to make a couple of the furniture blocks, unless I have some in here. Um, I don't see any of those in here. Okay, so... Um, we need to make those then, so we'll probably do that in the artisan table. 
concrete, brick, awning, farm plot, stone. Sinks and toilets. Do we just use these for furniture blocks? I don't think so. I mean, we can make them look like furniture, but they, I don't know that if they're functional as such. Maybe they are. If we, oh, this is kind of neat. A wood frame farm plot raised. Oh, that's cool. Is that, is that a vanilla thing? Huh. I don't know. That's, that's pretty neat though. I, I, I've never noticed that before. Okay. Anyway, uh, how do I make the furniture blocks? Let's take a look. Furniture. Carpenter's table. Right. Duh. Okay. <clears throat> so let's make sectional leather couch. That's a selectable item too. Scrap iron. Wooden double doors. Oh, we should look at those. Here we go. Uh, we need paint for that. We should have plenty of paint in somewhere. Uh, no. <clears throat> Excuse me. That would be in here. Yeah, we got lots of paint. Okay. So... Wood storage, cardboard box. Okay. Okay. So let's make a few of these. I don't know how many I'm going to want. We'll make, well, I guess five's all we can make. We need to get some more glue going. So for that, we need bone powder. Oh, we have, oh, look at that. Okay. <laughs> we have all kinds of glue and stuff in there. Well, not all kinds, but is this where we're keeping empty jars? Yeah. Okay. Well, let's start with these five anyways, and then we'll go from there. Do I have my paintbrush too? Probably not. In fact, you know what? Let me let me get rid of uh, some of this extra scrap here first. So give me a second here. All right. So let's go in here and... What we want to do is we want this to be I'm going to go with the red stuff and let's try this cupboard here. Uh, you know what though? That's not going to look right for what I want to do. Okay. Yeah, we can't use, well, we could put this up here though. Maybe. I don't know. Is that, that might look weird though. Cause it's, the side of it's still kind of sticking out there. Yeah, okay. Probably not. All right, let's go back into here. So we're going to put down this one because we can use it uh, for to actually put stuff inside of an actual cabinet. Um, for that matter, this is not that. So let's do the same thing here. Okay, and then uh, we'll put here. Let's go. Let's go look at those again for, for just a second. How oh, they got that set up in here. Okay, so they got a, a three-block space there, and then just a long, long thingy there. Gotcha. Okay. I'm, I'm not going to do that exactly, but we're going to do something similar to that. So I'm thinking... Oh, you know what else? Let, let's go get... Let's go get our... I'm making this up as I go, okay? <laughs> so just bear with me, guys. I'm making this up as I go. Okay, so we want the research station. So let's pick this up. 
And what's this? This is a tailor station. Um, I don't, well, here, let's, do I have anything in here? Let's grab it. It's not going to stay in here regardless. But I'm not sure if I'm going to put it in the bedroom or not. Did we get everything out of here? Yeah, this is a nice fridge, though, so let's not destroy it. We're going to pick it up. So the most important piece for in here is the research desk. So <clears throat> I'm thinking we can either put it there. Yeah, I, th I think I want to put it that there. And then we can put this here. And then... Probably that there. Okay. I like the this shelf here. So if we <clears throat> do a copy shape and rotation, we can put two shelves in there. Um, I like these shelves across here. Here, copy shape and rotation. Oh, wait a second. Copy shape. Oh, that must be a different, a different thingy then. Okay. Let's finish the desk then. So what we want to do here is. Can we do a copy shape here? Oh, no, that's not what we want to do. All right, let's just do it this way. We are looking for... See, the, mm, there's different thicknesses, though, of this plate. Wood frames pole plate centered T. Pole plate centered T2. That's a th thicker one, or that one has a trim on it? What's this look like? Yeah, that's re that's actually really thick. What about this? Same thing. All right, well, I wasn't actually planning on putting a T in there anyways. I'm just kind of experimenting <clears throat> with that. Um... There's so many cool options in here, man. I still haven't used all of these. Well, okay, let's just go with the normal plate. And we want to rotate it so that it's um, on top because it's going to be like the surface of the desk. Like this. It's mm, <clears throat> it's a little thicker though than the top of the cabinet. All right, let's go down. Sorry, let's go downstairs again. And oh yeah, that's the same thing down here too. It's a little thicker than top of the cabinet. Okay, gotcha. Um, while we're here, let's also just grab this texture so it's ready to go. And we'll go get these painted, and this this will be our desk. And then we're going to set up, like, some computers and that sort of thing. Oh, right. We got... We need... <coughs> excuse me. We want to upgrade it first. And we need wooden planks for that. What do you know? What do you know, man? What do you know? Let's get some wooden planks. You know what would be cool <clears throat> is to have a um, a flip up, you know, kind of countertop to walk through here, but I don't think we're gonna be able to to make that happen. So 
I mean, we can we can still pretend that that's what it is. But... Okay, we'll get that upgraded too. And now we want this to be the nice wood texture. Um, here, let's tell it to copy the whole side for those and for that. All right, now back to. Do we just hit that again to tell it not to paint all sites? Okay, that we want to do the red texture. And all sites. There we go. Back to here. Turn all sides off. Okay. Let's also um, get these painted. Uh, those must be like some kind of trim block or something. What if we did... Yeah, let's do this instead. Oh, I like that. Actually, like, <clears throat> excuse me, that marble tile look. Hmm. What if we did our bathroom in this and got rid of this grunge? Ooh, me likey. Me likey. That'll improve things in here. bad we couldn't do a nice toilet. You know, I'm tempted to break out this grungy looking mirror and just put a medicine cabinet in here. Uh, do we have a medicine cabinet in our stuff? If not, we can loot one. Um, well, we got the medical cabinet. It wasn't quite what I had in mind, but that could look okay. You know, too. Yeah. Mucho betero. Get rid of the grunge tile here. We want to have a classy kitchen, baby. <clears throat> We just hit that base too, yeah. Athletic skill has improved. Yeah, that looks that looks a lot better. A lot better. <clears throat> okay. Oh right, we were looking to do this. Oh, that's just painted. Okay. I was thinking that was uh, actual glass. Concrete mix. It's going to be in here. In that case, then we just have to paint it. Um, trying to decide if we'll, we'll get that light working too when we do all the wiring, trying to decide if I like that trim piece up there or not, or if we should put a different trim piece up there. Well, let's just leave that the way it is for now. All right, why can't I put it? Oh, because of that trim piece. All right, well, that. 
See, I don't think I like that up high like that. What we could do is keep this here and then get a medicine cabinet for this side. I kind of like that. Okay. Anyway, we got a little sidetrack, but that's all right. This is fun. I love doing this stuff. That's one of the things I really like about this game is you have so many options for, you know, building and decorating. I just wish the textures, some of the textures were nicer. I mean, I get it. It's the apocalypse and all, but still. For those of us who occasionally want to make something really nice, the game has everything in place except for good textures. <laughs> you know, it's like, come on, man. Uh, all right. We want this to be cabinet drawers. And is this on or off? How do I tell if that's on or off? It doesn't paint all sides. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, it's off. So we'll make that into a cabinet and that into a cabinet. Um, it doesn't really make sense to make those look like cabinets, even though we can still store things inside of them. Okay, I'm liking it so far. I'm liking it so far now. Uh, what, how do we make those? We probably have to, uh, 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 I'm trying to think here. What would this look like? Hmm. It's a nice shiny surface. Here, let's change the windowsill. Nah, I, I think I like the wood better. Okay, let's go back to the wood. Okay, now, next thing is uh, we want to put our chair in here. Uh, maybe let's have it kind of sitting at an angle like so. And then we've got a PC and just a normal computer. So All right, or or this. This is a single block, and it can go in at an angle. So we could put it there. You know what, though? That would be a nice place for a desk safe, I think. Do we want it there or over one? I think that looks better, especially if we put a desk safe over here. All right. I don't know if this lamp's going to stay lit. If I put it here, we won't. Yeah, see, it's not lit, but I think we can wire it. I think we can wire that up to turn it back on. We might not need that there, though. Uh, we could also put the desk safe on top of here. Okay, so let's decide what we're going to paint the walls. And and I need to figure out the, those shelves, too. Well, we could put cabinets up there, actually. Yeah, that would look better. Okay, so let's do that. Let's go here and here. And, ooh, even better bookcases. Me likey. Oh, there's the... No, that's something different. But, hey, this is actually even a better idea. Wasn't even thinking along these lines. Uh, on face. Oh, we need to make a couple more of those. And also. Uh, 
Let's take care of this crap. Yeah, that, that makes the bathroom look a lot nicer. I think, too, we probably want to do that as well. Let's go get some more furniture pieces. Now, what am I short? Nails? We have lots of nails. I think those are in here. Oh, we don't have lots of nails. I don't have any in there either. Okay, we need to make some nails. We do that in here. Okay, so we can use scrap or those. Oh, I see. Okay, we can either make them in here or we can make them in the blacksmith forge. I think I'd rather use scrap iron, though. Uh, we don't need 1,100 nails. How about 100? There we go. Okay, let's let those cook up. Copy shape, copy rotation, and put that in there. And I think we can make those red. Whoops. Oh. Oh, okay. Here, let's do it this way then. Let's do paint all sides. And then remove paint all sides and paint the bookshelf back on the front bookcase. There we go. That looks good. That's looking good in the neighborhood. All right, we need to get this wall changed over. In fact, all these walls in here are grunge. So what can we do? I mean, the black marble does look good, but I don't want to overdo it with the black marble either. Um, we could, I, I really like this black ceiling tile look. Um, so we'll probably just keep using that for the ceiling. Maybe, mm, yeah, sure, why not? Let's just put it the entire ceiling and we'll probably make the every ceiling on this floor this texture that's just the way it is um if we go to paint roller we can do that and then ah uh, no i don't want that to happen okay yeah, I better do the rest as singles, otherwise it's going to do stuff I don't want it to do. Well, no, actually, we probably could do a paint roller in the center of this. Sort of. <laughs> um, okay, let me get all this fixed. Okay, that looks good. It's coming along. Um, how about if we take this couch, pick it up, and turn it around? Is it not? It's not giving me an option to pick it up. All right, I don't like it right there in the middle of the floor. I guess the uh, the idea is you're looking out the window, but. Okay. I think what we need to do is, well, having this table here could be useful. 
It's a big table we could like lay out, out a map on or something. Uh, I'm just not sure about the booths though. Can I pick those up? Nope. I think the booths look a little odd. All right. Well, I'm I'm not I'm still undecided about that. So I'm not going to do anything until I make a decision on that. Um let's go over here for a minute. I'm going to grab whatever that was that I used before. And let's fix these up. Um, yeah, I don't think I want that whole thing to be marble. I really like the way the kitchen's looking. It's looking good. We'll keep the stereo speakers there. We need to fix the, the windows. But, you know, we're going to have to have a, a window sesh. <laughs> or I'll do either that or I'll just do it off camera, but oh I guess I guess I have to fix that too. Um let's set this back to this blacker look there. We'll do the same for the other sills. If I yeah, this is risky. Paint all sides. Where's the thing where you can paint? Yeah, the surface. Okay, so that paints the entire surface. I should have been using that all along for, like, the ceiling. That would have saved me a lot of time, huh? I just forgot about that. Okay, looking better. Did we get this one up here? Yeah, I think we did. So it paints everything on that surface. That's that texture. So that's that's nice. Me likey. All right, very good. Um, so we do have like a little kind of closet, closety looking thing. Is there any better carpet in this game, or does it all just look like shit? <laughs> um, what do we got here? Concrete purple, awning green. Carpet four, carpet five, carpet six, carpet two, carpet one. All right, what? That's that's nicer, actually, quite a bit nicer. Oh, that was weird. Um, okay, we want paint all sides, I think. There we go. Come on. Why isn't it? Come on, game. You're killing me. There you go. Okay. I guess you have to be on a certain surface. That's better. That's better than that gr grungy looking brown stuff anyway. Okay, I think we'll keep the floor as it is. It's It's a little dirty, but... I like the, you know, that that wood texture. So really the I think the last thing we have to decide for in here um is what we want to paint the walls. I don't I don't like the grungy white. We could do the same thing we did in here. Why don't we try that and just see uh if if I like it? And paint surface. Oh, shit. Well, you know what? That's easy enough to fix. What's it going to do if I do it over here? Okay, that's better. That I'm probably going to do by hand as well. Okay, this is definitely better. What's that going to do? Screw up that a little bit.
And of course, you know, we don't have any lighting in here. In fact, why don't we just temporarily put a lantern up, but we will put wired lighting in here. So let's go here. Grab, whoops. Oh, I want to grab my bulletin board, maybe a couple of these poster thingies. Oh, there's modern couch there. Okay, let's grab that and grab the lanterns. I don't think there's anything else in here that I want. Uh, I do want to... S well, do we want to put a corner safe there or not? We already have a wall safe, even though it's kind of... I mean, it's in a weird spot. <laughs> so, let's grab the bulletin board. And also... I'm just going to, like I said, temporarily put some lighting in here that we'll fix later. guess we'll put it there. Put one there and like that. Again, temporarily. Okay. Let me, let me finish uh, the painting first and then uh, we'll put some wall hangings up. I just got to fix a couple things here. Okay, guys, so we got the the painting fixed. Um, what kind of options do we have with these couches? Oh, we got some different colors. What does the red look like? It kind of match would match our red office chair. Yeah, actually, you know what we're going to do? We are going to... Get rid of these booths, because I don't like them anyway. This is our map table. I'm wondering, though, if we should move this back into the corner. Yeah, I, I, I like the idea of a map table, but I want to move it back into the corner. So let's take this out oh you know what let's go down here again for a second I really like this glass table this is cool looking man we should try and we should try to recreate this uh yeah, let's let's see if we can recreate that. Now we're gonna need whatever we did to, uh, for the bathroom shower. Yeah, we need that stuff. I don't remember exactly what it was that I used for that. Well, we will figure it out, man. We have a washing machine. Oh, you know what? We need a laundry room, too. <laughs> the laundry room is maybe where we should put the tailoring station. That kind of makes sense. Um, all right. So what do we use for the windows? Window blocks. It would have been glass block, probably. Bulletproof glass. Glass. Uh, do I have any of those? Concrete. This one. Okay. Let's just craft one to make sure that's the right thing. Business class plate. Hmm. No, that isn't the same thing as what we used for in here. Okay, I gotta I gotta remember what that was. <laughs> I completely well here, hold on a second. Let let me look at something here. So Let's go back to here for a second. 
Um, business glass plate. What does that actually look like? If we... Yeah, see the problem the problem with that it's is it's really hard to see unless unless we painted can we paint just the edge of that to put like a trim on it so we can see it? I don't know, let's find out. No, you can't. Okay. Okay, I, got, I just got to remember what I did. So give me a second here and I'll figure it out. Oh, I know what I did. I pulled it out of the creative menu, which means I need to, to actually uh, pay for that stuff in the materials. All right, well, let's, let's look in the creative menu just to see what it's called. Uh... It's not these. Bulletproof glass, opaque, centered. What does that look like? Hmm. That could make that could make kind of a that gives me an idea actually. Well, is there a there's probably man I keep lagging here. There's probably not a texture for this, is there? No, it just changes it to red. Okay. Um. Okay. So yeah, let's go back into here. Was it glass or window that we used? Maybe it was window. Yeah, okay, so it was so it was window. Window store. Trap window. Metal win metal window, that's what it was. Metal window. Okay. So that's probably gonna be May where is that going to be made in the here? Let's try the artisan's table. Bulletproof, yeah, right here. That's what we're looking for. Okay, so let's make four of these. And actually, how many do I owe the game for the shower? Looks like six. Okay, so we'll make a total of ten, and then I'll just after I make. Six of those, we'll just throw them away to pay for, pay for those. Uh, oh, crap! It in the workbench. Hey. Okay. There we go. All right. Let me break this. Thing me thingy me doodle here. Okay, so there's no round shape to these. And I think I think what we want to do is grab this piece here. And then get it rotated properly. Good. Um, <clears throat> you know what, though? I should have probably put those in facing up. Because we're not going to be able to put anything underneath. But if I put him in facing up, then we can't put anything on top of the table. 
All right, then I think what I want to do is grab this and put it there. I know it doesn't look really good, but this needs to have some kind of a support on it. And I want, you know, I want to be able to put something on top of this table so they have to stay pointing down. That's just all there is to it. Okay. So let's grab this texture and, oh, wait, we want to upgrade it first. Where is me nail gun? Nail gun, there you are, right in front of my noggin. And I can't see it. There we go. I wish we could paint this black. But we can't. Okay. Now, I think we should also have um, a chair there. So let's go back downstairs and see what our options are for more chairs. I don't think I want like a cushy office chair there. I want more like a, well, we got those kind of chairs there. Can I pick those up even? Yeah. That's not the quite what I had in mind. I'd kind of like to have an office chair without arms, you know, that sort of chair. I don't suppose we can paint these things, can we? No. All right, well, I'll tell you what. Let's just grab a couple of these for now. And... Let's look in here for a second. Chair. All of those have arms. Barracks chair. Old chair. So I guess we don't have an office chair in this game that doesn't have arms. Okay, fair enough. We'll just use these then. Um, but we could change the color. Is that something we can just do in a menu, or do we have to make it a specific color? Yeah, see, this is all just for rotation and all of that. All right, you know what we're going to do then? We're going to... Old chair brown, red, blue, white... We've been kind of doing the the red theme in that room. So let's grab two of those and we'll pay for them by getting rid of those. Well, those look like shit too, but <laughs> they don't they're a little bit they match a little bit better. We're just trying to do the best we can with what we have to work with, ladies and gentlemen. That's all there is to it. Put that there. Um, you know what? Might actually look cool there as a gun safe. I know this isn't the armory, but... Here, I want to do something different. Pick this back up. Yeah, let's put that at an angle. All right, let's get the couch down next. We're getting we're getting there. This takes time, man. You got <laughs> you got to really think through things. And when you're making it up as you go, it takes even more time. But when it's all said and done, it should look cool. All right, I think we're going to go with the red couch option here. And why don't we just have it go there? there and I guess we can just turn the corner like that see here the problem I don't with this is that I don't like it up against the stairs but I want it centered on the window Okay, I got an idea for that. Okay, 
let's grab these. Go back into here. And look at a couple of possibilities here. What is that? Oh, it's just different trims on the wood frame. All right. What if we what if we grab this circle thing's kind of interesting. See, hmm, I don't know how that's going to paint. But what I want to do is I want to put a plant on there. I don't know if I have any plants. Okay, we're just going to pull one of those out of creative. Uh, potted plant. That just... That's all we have, just that, huh? There's no, like, variation to these? How's that, eh? All right, let's paint this. Um, I think we'll give this the oak color. And why don't we give the other part of it the marble color? Why isn't that painting? Is it because this is in the way? Hmm. All right, hold on. I think we need, might need to rotate this. <laughs> if... I'm the I'm just trying to figure out how I can rotate it and know which way it's going before I upgrade it, you know? Maybe it'll maybe that'll be obvious. Oh yeah, okay, it is obvious. That's what we want. Okay. Now let's upgrade it. And I think we, where's that wood texture? This. I want that to be the wood texture and then the part that the plant will sit on can be this marble. There we go. Um, okay. There's my plant. Give me my plant. And then we'll put the couch piece back. I like that. I like it. Don't like this, though. That's not supposed to be that way. There we go. We'll get these lights um, fixed up and, and, and lit up. I, I like the way the lights are in here, too. Um, okay, so I think we're just about done, guys. Uh, I just want to hang a couple of things. Can we put the bulletin board... Eh, we can't put the bulletin board... It'd be, like, perfect to put it right behind the desk there, but it's not going to let us do that. So, um, hmm... That doesn't look right. That doesn't make sense because you wouldn't put a bulletin board out of reach. I guess we'll put it there. All right. Now, we need to... Wait a minute, why does that look like that? Oh. 
So we can't we can't actually cover that wall safe. So how there must be different types of wall safes. This one's protruding. See, I was gonna put the picture over it, but it's not letting me do it. So well damn it, Jim. Alright. Well let's put this here then. And we have a couple more. Put that there. We could put the cigarette and see that one. Oh, this is a two block high thing. Oh, I see. Okay. Couldn't figure out why it wasn't fitting there. Well, then it probably, let's just put it there. Just to add some deco to the place. What if we... Oh, TVs, yeah. We want we want to set up a, a wall TV in here. So we can monitor the zombie activity across the region. be there it wouldn't make sense to put it behind the bed because we wouldn't be able to see it there if we're sitting on the couch and we want to watch tv not that we're gonna well maybe you you know maybe we found like an old uh dvd player or something and we can watch old movies <laughs> then it might actually make sense to put the the tv up here Yeah, I, I don't know. That looks kind of weird. I, I like the idea of, of this, though, too. So let's put a monitor there as well. All right, you guys. I think we are just about done in here. Oh, I have the water cooler. I was th Oh, you know what? I was thinking about putting a safe there. Let's go back into creative. What options do we have? So these safes here, we're probably going to want to put in the armory a brewmaster safe. What the hell is that? <laughs> That's just a wall safe. Desk safe. What reinforced secure steel safe? I'm just curious as to what these look like. If we end up using it, we will definitely pay for it. See, that way we can keep our valuable blueprints in the safe. Okay, I like that. Before we commit, though... Well, first of all, can I even make these, or does this require a schematic? It looks like they can be made in the workbench because, you know, I don't want to give myself something that I haven't learned the schematic for because then we wouldn't be able to pay for it, right? Safe. Whoops. Oh, yeah, we can make these. Okay. Well, then, um, I, I want to see what the... Here, let's pay for the shower by throwing those out. Uh, I want to see what these lockers look like. In fact, let's see what this look. Uh, nope, wrong menu. Let's see what this looks like too. Okay, so that attaches to a wall and sticks out. Hmm. What if we? Wait a minute, though. No, that doesn't make sense because there's a shelf behind there. All right, what if we do this? Pick this back up. Put that there. Grab this again. Uh, we could... 
could put this in this corner here. Yeah, let's just do that. Oh, oh, I was gonna say, did it just disappear? <laughs> um, what was I thinking? Oh, right. I, I want to look at the lockers too, just to see what they look like. So secure steel lockers, secure steel lockers. That looks kind of neat too, actually. I don't know. I, I'm I'm feeling the safe though. I'm feeling the safe. There we go. And we actually have two safes now. Um is there something we could put up there? I was gonna grab this other computer see the problem with this computer though is it doesn't you can't put it at an angle like you can with this one no you know what this is our this is supposed to be like our map table so we don't we don't want anything on there is there like a an actual map? Like just a deco map? No. Doesn't look like it. Okay. Well, I might want to put something up there, but I, I'm not sure what it would be at this point. Unless we took this down, because we already have that wall safe up there. It's it's you know it's kind of like that wall is a little bit busy. The only thing with this is I can't center it. All right. Well, maybe we find another picture and we put two side by side. Or come up with a, another solution later. Are we done? <laughs> um, I think we've made really good progress here. Let's take and put... Well, here, we could do this. Uh, where is this? Taylor Station. Why don't we just put the Taylor Station there for now? I don't know if I'm going to keep it there permanently, but we'll put it there for now. And... Um... What do we have? Okay. We have like, this is kind of like a little wardrobe thingy up here. I think too, by the way, now that I'm looking at this, that we want to do that. Yeah. The water cooler can go in this corner. No. In this corner. Better. Me likey. Me likey. Okay. All right, you guys, uh, aside from wiring and fixing these windows, and we're going to we're gonna need to make the bulletproof glass for that just to so it matches, I think we're finished in here. I like how it came together. I am going to want to, you know, uh, get some storage taken care of. Um, yeah, we got, we got quite a few slots in here that we can use um, for schematics. We'll put schematics and books and money. Those sorts of things, anything that's related to research data in there. And, you know, we've got storage in these cabinets and things, but I, I got to kind of think that through off camera on how I exactly it is that I want to organize that. And if we're going to keep the Taylor's station in here, you know, it, it's going to make, 
It's going to make more sense to put this in the armory because that's where we're going to make armor. So, yeah, uh, let's just leave that there for now. But I, th I think I'm going to put that in the armory unless I change my mind later, which, you know, old guy's prerogative and all that. Okay, guys, that takes care of getting our bedroom ready, except for what is this piece of shit doing here? Do we have any more of those furniture blocks? Okay, that's not what we need. If they're not called dresser, what the hell are they called? Here. Nightstand. That is not a nightstand. <laughs> Come on, fun pimps. It's not a freaking nightstand. It's a dresser. <laughs> Okay, that's, that explains it. Okay. I don't suppose we can paint this. We could put one there. In fact, I kind of like that idea better so we're not blocking the view. And then we can put our... um you know, clothing items, you know, not armor, but clothing items in there. All right. I think we've done enough damage for one day. Guys, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this. This was fun. I, I had a good time uh, doing this and we have a lot more to do. So the plan for the next episode will probably be to keep, we'll keep working up here. Um, and we'll, I, I need to give this some thought as to how I want the armory room to go. Um, really there, there's two things in my mind, right? We could either, um, do one just big open room and put like vault doors in, um, or we could have an open area and then, uh, like a steel enclosed vaulted area. That, you know, like that we could walk into. Um, if we did that, though, there's not I don't think there's going to be enough room in this space because I'm going to want to put safes in the in the, you know, the gun. Oh, you know what? We need to go out and grab some of those weapons racks and armor racks. Uh, we can loot those. So we need to go to, to like a shotgun messiah or a sporting goods store. So maybe what we'll do is we'll either do that and or. We will work on this. But like I said, I, I just got to give this some thought. If you guys have any ideas too, feel free to share them, of course. Um, I guess the question would be, should we do one big, large, open vaulted uh, or one big, large room? Um, and, you know, paint. we're going to paint it to look like it's metal and reinforced and all that jazz. Or should we have an open area and then also have an actual vault that we walk into? Uh, so that's that's kind of the question. So let me know what you guys think. And um, we'll go from there. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share the video. I will probably get another one of these recorded before Thanksgiving. But in case I don't, for all, all of you who celebrate it, have a happy Thanksgiving. Eat lots of turkey and enjoy time with friends and family. All right, guys. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.